Hi, in this video we are going to learn about human organ system. Okay, so look at the picture. Here we have a uh, five organ systems. See, basically our body has a uh, any organ systems. Okay, each systems responds for some function. Okay, right. So what you have to do here? We have to find out the system. Okay, and uh, mention the organ system and functions okay what are the organs involved okay right so look at the first one can you guess this skeletal system okay what is the second system circulatory system what is the third one respiratory system what is the fourth one digestive system what is the fifth one muscular system okay so here we have a uh, five organ systems okay see we are going to learn what is the function what are the organs involved in this system okay right see first one skeletal system so what are the functions of skeletal system okay see it provides shape and form of the body okay right and also gives protection right and uh, use uh, body movement okay right see various organs found inside our body every organs uh, completely protected by the skeletal system okay right so what are the organs involved here see bones and connective tissue including cartilage tendons and ligaments okay so these are the organs involved in the skeletal system okay right what is the second one already said that circulatory system okay right so what are the functions of the organ system delivers oxygen and nutrients to cells and takes away waste okay right so with the help of the circulatory system the blood carries important things to the body cells okay like food water hormones enzymes okay blood cells everything to the body cells and also it carries waste materials from the cells to the excretory organs okay right so what are the organs involved here heart blood vessels and blood you all know very clearly heart so organs helps to pump the blood okay blood vessels there are three kind of blood vessels arteries veins capillaries okay blood vessels are nothing but a tube which carries blood to various parts of the body cells okay right blood See, blood is a connective tissue fluid. It's made up of two important components. Okay, one is plasma, another one is blood cells. Okay, right. Next, what is the third system? Respiratory system. Okay. What is the function of the respiratory system? Breathing gas. Okay. Usually, we inhaling oxygen and exhaling carbon dioxide. Okay. So, while inhaling, the oxygen enters through the nose and pass through the trachea and reaches the lungs okay lungs load with the air bladders okay right then finally blood carries oxygen to all parts of the body cells at the same time blood also carries deoxygenated blood from the various parts of body cells and tick towards the heart and finally go to the lung okay and then finally we exhaling carbon dioxide okay right so what are the organs involved in the respiratory system lungs trachea and nose okay what's the fourth system digestive system okay right what are the functions digesting foods so usually we eating uh, different kinds of food okay solid food semi solid food uh, liquid items okay see once we eat all those things what will happen everything digested okay basically we eating food or called a solid things once the digestion is over the solid things become a smaller molecule okay soluble smaller molecules in our body cells okay right so what are the organs involved mouth food pipe stomach liver pancreas small intestine large intestine and a anus okay see these are all the various organs present in the entire gastrointestinal tract okay see our gastrointestinal tract start from the mouth and in the anus in between there are various organs each organs are responsible for some functions okay right what is the fifth one muscular system right what is the function of the muscular system 
movements body movements okay is only muscles attached with the bones okay bone alone cannot move okay uh, bones must attach with the muscles okay then only we can move our body parts okay right see what are the organs involved skeletal muscle smooth muscle and cardiac muscle okay right with the help of these three kind of muscles we can move our body organs okay right see look at the picture here we have a uh, human digestive systems there are various pictures given here we have to find the organs okay right first one what is the first one stomach okay right stomach is nothing but a thick walled bag okay it secretes digestive juice including hcl and other enzymes okay it can expand their shape according to the food quantity okay right okay what is the second picture teeth okay see with the help of teeth we are chewing the food materials okay right see uh, we have a uh, 32 number of teeth okay for incisor to canine for premolar and six molars okay so with the help of all these teeth we using cutting and grind the food particles next one is small intestine see small intestine secretes the various enzymes okay here 100 percent of digestion is over here okay so once the digestion is over the digested food entered into the finger like organs known as villi okay right what is the fourth one mouth see mouth has various parts teeth tongue salivary glands okay see salivary glands uh, secretes saliva okay with the help of the saliva starch can be digested in the mouth itself what is the fifth one saliva which is secreted from the salivary gland okay see saliva contains uh, enzymes known as amylase and also mucin okay see saliva digest starch what is the sixth one large intestine okay see once the digestion is over the small intestine undigested and unabsorbed food come towards the large intestine okay what is the function of large intestine it absorbs water and salts from the undigested and unabsorbed food materials okay and finally it become to semi solid okay right what is the seventh one tongue so usually we using tongue for speaking tasting the foods and mixing the food with the saliva okay and swallowing the food okay it contains a taste buds okay see tip of the tongue helps to taste sweet behind the tip of the tongue helps to taste salt because it has buds okay and sides of the tongue helps to taste sore and back of the tongue helps to taste bitter because these all parts as taste bud okay right what is the eighth one food pipe okay see through the food pipe the semi solid food is known as bolus reaches to the stomach from the mouth okay okay i love you i hope you all understood thank you